And here we go, the bulgogi. We got these delicious noodles. Ho, ho, ho. We have the rice cake, we have sprouts, never ending sprouts, and we have the beef. Best thing to do is just go in, grab a big mix, right? That's a little too much sprouts there. And here we go, let's try this. It's so good. It's not spicy at all, it's a little sweet. Mm. Good evening everyone, this is David Hoffman from David's Bin here in bustling Seoul, South Korea. Tonight we're gonna to be exploring the Hyundai area and this is like an entertainment district. We have lots of shops, we have street food, we have restaurants, Korean and Western. And as you can see, lots of youth here. Everybody's like 20 and under, I'd say 25 and under. A lot of youth because there's a lot of universities in the area. And what we're doing tonight is we're gonna explore, we're gonna go shopping, and we're gonna go eat some Korean food. I don't know exactly what we're gonna eat. We're just gonna look around and see what looks good. And I'm sure we're gonna try some delicious craft beer from Korea. You know, all the youth, there has to be good beer here. All right, guys. <laughs> Let's go explore Hyundai. All right, guys, so as you can see, entertainment district, we got some games. We're gonna just uh, throw some darts, see if I win anything. 5,000 for seven shots. All right, I'll try it. 5,000. Any balloon. Any balloon. One or two. Make one, I get this. Make four, I get one of those. Make seven, get one of these. You feeling confident? Yeah, let's, let's. <laughs> it's been a while, it's been a while. Oh, oh dude. One. one. Two. Two. Ah. Oh. Three. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh dude. So three. Anything from there? Can I see? Let me see. Oh, wow. Oh, that's awesome. You did well, man. I did well, right? Yeah. Man, I didn't bring a bag. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be carrying that all night. Oh, my God. What did this happen? <laughs> I guess I'll get this. Is this Korean? Okay, okay. It's Korean. It's Korean? What's oh, yeah. Korean? Totoro, Totoro. 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 Okay. Totoro. I'll take this one. That was you, awesome. What's the name? Totoro? Totoro. 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 Okay. Let you me got tie Totoro. him. Where am I tying him to? Right there? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. So she got like two, so she gets to get one of those. Yeah. This guy's being very nice. He's letting everybody get the bigger ones. Yeah, so I'm gonna walk around with this. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna buy a backpack. <laughs> you need one, huh? It's crazy. Dude, this is fun. It's fun. This, this is, is like an awesome area. super fun area. Yeah, just the beginning of it. It sprawls out in all directions. Hongdae is actually pretty big. And um, man, Hongdae is so big that I remember there was one bar when I came here a lot, many years ago where they had four different versions of it. It was like, I, I, I actually think it was called the Hobart. It was like Hobart 1, 2, 3, and 4. Oh my God. It's hilarious, man. Dude, I'm so excited. This is super fun. This is what the funnest part about Korea is that you have this type of stuff. I don't see this anywhere else in the world. No. Right? Like you go through an area, restaurants, street food, this is, games. This is pure fun. Pure fun. The performance was sick. That was oh, K-pop, right? K-pop. Uh, it was like K-pop. I think it was a little bit of a. It's break, like break dancing. There's a, there's a word for that. Yeah, there's but they were but that. they weren't break dancing. They were just no, like no, doing no. a they certain. Just, uh, they're just doing the thing. Oh my god! And then you cross the street, and it's another street. It's lit up. It's lit up. Wow. Keeps going, dude. But you think there's food over here? Uh, Restaurants. Yeah, they got everything over there, man. Make sure you run over to the barbecue. <laughs> we can always go back. We can always go back. Let's go check out this place first. Okay. <laughs> 
The street has souvenirs, phone covers, street food, lots of lights, but it's starting to rain, so we're gonna go look for a restaurant. I think we're gonna eat what? I think we're gonna have pulgo pulgogi. Pulgogi? pulgogi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We tried that just very briefly with uh, that big Korean royal feast we had like over a week ago. Okay. We've never had a dedicated bulgogi meal. Let's Should go. We, let's do it. All right, so we just had on the restaurant, and this is like a super packed restaurant. Very cozy, as you can see, and they have bulgogi, marinated beef, Korean style, and we have it right here. Check this out. Whoa, ah. it's big. Oh my god. Oh man, I can't wait. I got my soju. Love it. 20% alcohol. So good. <laughs> got some rice right here. Some rice with some seaweed. And we have a delicious like seaweed soup. Oh, everything looks fire. Then I'm gonna start with the soup and some soju. So open this up. Alright, here's how it works. Getting a little help too. Yeah, yeah. She comes, she helps. Try some. Mm. Oh wow. Mm. Nice. I love it. It's like vodka, but smoother. Smooth. Now let me let me show you this. So I'm gonna serve myself a little bit of seaweed. Sandwich time is when people drink or you know, this is what people eat on their birthdays here. Yeah, correct? yeah, it's called miyoku. Miyoku. Yeah. Mm. It's like a lucky soup, I think. Mm. <laughs> Fantastic. Seaweed. Yeah, nice light broth. What's really cool about this dish is that it's like covered in bean sprouts. Yeah. Wow. So many sprouts. So like, many sprouts. Where's where's the beef? The beef the beef is kinda hidden. Gumbe. Gumbe. Match the soil? Match the soil. Okay, dude, this is ready to eat. The lady came by and said it was finished. What she did is she added some nice thick noodles, mixed it around. And so, yeah, we've got a delicious bread. It's like basically we have the, the bean sprouts, which are called gong namul in Korean. We have rice cakes, we have uh, noodles, and, and beef, of course. So, I'm gonna try the beef on its own right now. Oh man. Got some noodles. Bulgogi. It's a bulgogi, it's next level. So tasty. Look at those, nice and big, long. <laughs> mm. Oh man. Big and thick. The nice thing is that the noodles really absorb the sauce. So, very flavorful. Mm, I love this sauce. It's not overly spicy, a little bit of a kick. It's actually a bit more sweet than, it's, than, than spicy, I'd say. I love it though, I love it. And here we go, the bulgogi. We got these delicious noodles. Ho oh, ho ho! We have the rice cake, we have sprouts, never ending sprouts, and we have the beef. Best thing to do is just go in, grab a big mix, right? That's a little too much sprouts there. Oh, get some of that. And here we go, let's try this. Oh, whoa. Oh, it's so good. It's not spicy at all. It's a little sweet. Mm. I love how crunchy the, the sprouts are. Oh, and the rice cake in there as well. I didn't even know that was there until I bit into it. Look at that, man. The beef is freaking delicious. And it's, it has it actually does have a little bit of a kick, but it just tingles in your, your upper lip. Mm. And these noodles remind me of like buckwheat noodles that I have in China. And man, what a dish. And I love that we're, that we're sharing it here, you know? Instead of having our own dish. Yeah, yeah. It's better like this. Korean, then, Korean food is very communal. Yeah, I know. It's like, almost like China, because China, every single thing you eat is shared. But here, the great thing is that you always have it in the middle on top of a little fire. Always. Yeah. Yeah. I love it, man. Oh, let me get a little more. Oh, so many sprouts. That section is too hot. Dude, uh, gumbe, gumbe. 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 Oh man, sold you all day. Right, so we're about to move on to phase two. Look at this guys, this is the bokum bop, the rice. We got the seaweed, we got cheese. It's gonna be all mixed in. Oh. Okay. Awesome. Can't wait. 
Oh man, that's like. Chop, 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 chop. Today's too funny, dude. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, and the soup? Oh, wow. Meal cook. Meal cook. Dude, that's gonna be next level. Sauce. What is this? Mmm. 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 I don't know. If You're both spicy? More spicy? Oh, it's possible. Spicy. Okay. <laughs> All right, so she came and made the rice. It's incredible. First, she chopped up the remaining ingredients that we had. Then she added the rice in, grabbed a little bit more spicy sauce, and then we're melting the cheese on top. She said, cook it for a minute. It's going to be ready. It's going to be so good, man. I can't wait. And one thing they always do is they spread it out so it's all even, and then at the bottom it burns. The burnt rice is the best part. The best part. The best thing about Korean fried rice is they dump cheese on top. I mean, it just changes the whole game. This is so good. I love how she spread it around. It's crispy on the bottom. All the flavors, look at that. I mean, you got noodles, you have sprouts, you have beef, you have cheese, you have rice cake, you have rice. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> oh man. So I'm gonna go in here and grab some of this. Woo! Mix it with some more. Mm. Dude, the amount of flavor in there is insane. A little spice, we ask her for some more spice. It's perfect though, not too hot. Mmm, tastes seaweed. I love seaweed. Yeah. I love it. It's the best. So good. Super fresh. The rice, obviously the country of rice. We have the noodles. I mean, everything's so good. I think I have to get some more cheese though. Ooh. Like that. Oh, it's like. Oh, wow. Oh, I mean, come on, sorry, dude. <laughs> Oh wow. I'm gonna say it. Fried rice in Korea is better than China. <laughs> I'm serious though. Oh yeah. Nobody does fried rice better than Korea. I mean, no one adds this many different ingredients. I think that's the key. Because people add like, you know, carrots, corn, uh, chicken, yeah. pork, but they don't do this. No. Oh. Wow. Mm. The cheese, man. The, the cheese. cheese. The cheese for the win. Oh. Mm. It's too much, it's too yeah, much. Too good, too good. Yeah, sorry, I'm just gonna keep going. What a feast, man. That was insane. That food just like, it kept calming and calming. It's so cool to do the bokumbap too. Total price was 36,000 won for everything, including the alcohol. It's incredible value. I mean, basically 18,000 won per person. You're looking at about 15 US dollars, 15, 16 US dollars for all that meat, all those noodles, all that rice and the beer and the soju that's insane value loved it when i have like sushi in miami i'll spend easily with my wife 60 to 70 us dollars if i get some sake oh my gosh so this in korea number priceless. one number priceless. one deal dude it's priceless priceless i mean yeah there's a price but it's priceless it's priceless <laughs> all right i found another guy who's doing the same thing basically darts darts oh Oh, yeah. two, three. Oh, oh, dude. Oh, oh. nice. Let's That's see. it, dude. Can I? I want the monkey, man. <laughs> Nine. Nice. Ah! <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> I think my daughter's gonna love it. Memory for life, dude. That's great. So, so many bars, so many places where you can get chicken, Korean barbecue. But we're specifically looking for craft beer, so we're gonna walk one more block, and I think that's where we're gonna find it. And the reason we're drinking craft beer is because the other beer is water. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're beer snobs now. The dolphin made me do it. And the dolphin made you do it. <laughs> okay, so I looked at this place called Ale Crew Craft Beer Tap House. Craft beer in Korea. Let's go. Oh yeah, look at this. Dude, they're all the tanks. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, yes, sir, right here. Okay. Cheers! Come, babe! 
<laughs> you got the chimay. <laughs> what are you having? Uh, I'm having, well, it's sold out, but it's a IP, uh, slow IPA. So they're so nice. They, they just had this much left. They gave it to me and they allowed me to replace my beer. So basically, I get one and a quarter. The chimay white triple. So it's a Belgian triple. If you guys don't know about that, it's Belgian. Like, it's, it's the strongest beer they make. What is this? 8%. Pretty good. It's oh, also the most expensive. It is the most expensive. It's like $12, but look at that head. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 bro. Is that, is that this, good? This is, this is like a, this is a man's beer. Is it a life-changing beer? This is Belgian. Belgian, Belgian beer is the best. Gumbe. Oh wow. oh wow, it's delicious. Amazing craft beer spot. They got Korean beer on draft, all craft. They got everything. Imperial style, porter, ale, wheat ale, triple, Belgian triple. I mean, they got everything you could ever want. They also have other beers from other countries right here in bottles. And I love the setting. I mean, everybody's here, very young, casual, just drinking, eating some food. And outside they have like a garden. Dude, this place is sick. This place is really cool. And I highly recommend coming here when you come to this area. Just a more chill spot. Very like a lot less people in this area. Uh, it's separated from like the main strip. And yeah, cheers. Dambe all day. All day. Mm. What a fantastic place. Though. Awesome. Great way to end off the night of all day. Very young, very modern. Whoa, delicious craft beer. Dude, seriously. Korean style. Amazing. I love the atmosphere, love the taste, love the location too. Dude, right. thank you for bringing me here. This is awesome. Like, yeah. I, this, I think this is my favorite spot in Seoul. Yeah. I mean, so much, the best. so much youth, yeah. lots of things to do. I mean, I played some darts. Yeah. We ate some food. We saw some, like, uh, some people doing K pop. Like yeah, dancing, yeah. Right? There's always performances on the street. Thing is, this is, there's so much to do in this area. You could come back here. I swear, if you lived here, you could come back here every weekend and find a new place to eat, a new place to drink. Yeah. And yeah. what was the name of the food we had? Oh, we had the uh, bulgogi. Bulgogi. So good. Oh, yeah. that was unreal. I mean, the coolest thing is that, like, you know, you have a dish and it's like, yeah. that's not your dish because it mixes with rice and then they make it something else and it's oh, like, man. oh, wow. It never ends. It never ends. And we came here, had some craft beer. I mean, good nightcap and yeah, so much youth. So much youth. I mean, yeah. if you're in your mid 20s, you have to come to this area. <laughs> Dude, it makes me want to roll the clock back 10 years. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's not tell you our age. Yeah, we don't need to know. We're, we're, I'm a dad. Yeah. He's gonna be a dad. I, I'm, I'm older than you, so. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, if you love this video, give us a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you on the next travel adventure in Seoul, South Korea. Oh man, I love this country. Let's go. It's so good.